Obviously, uh, I had some mentors in my life as far as, if I go way back, uh, obviously my, my father and my brother were mentors. My father was a coach. Uh, he wasn't a teacher, but he was a coach. He coached uh, all the way to Babe Ruth, Little League, um, youth uh, basketball. And, and I joined it back then. Had an older brother that was also uh, probably a good mentor to me. Is he? Uh, he's he went into coaching. He went into teaching. I just kind of kind of followed his footsteps. And he still is today. He's still a teacher and a coach in, in Texas. He's been down there for 35 years. So um, I kind of followed in their footsteps and enjoyed every bit of it. Watching uh, kids succeed. You know, obviously, uh, it's kind of neat to see that some of the ex-players, ex-students that I've had uh, move on to, into their fields. And some of them are back here at school, uh, our teachers here as well. Uh, some are doctors, engineers, nurses, and, and so on. So obviously it's, it's kind of neat to see um, all those kids uh, uh, be successful in, in, their, uh, in their life. Again, my earlier years, I have to go back to uh, obviously my parents, um, like my father. Again, being a coach and a mentor, my brother as well, coach and mentor. Uh, as I got older and got into my career, uh, this might take a little bit, but uh, I don't want to forget anybody. But uh, coming, coming here, I had a chance to work with probably uh, the best coaching staff in uh, school history. And I don't think there will ever be one like it. Uh, where I worked with, I don't know how many Hall of Fame coaches, but I just don't want to forget them all. Uh, like Coach Braun in football, you know, two state titles, 300 some wins. Uh, obviously, uh, a great influence uh, in my football life. Uh, Coach Vina as well, Coach Defense, uh, two state titles, softball state title. Uh, if I keep going down the list, uh, Coach Houck, I had a chance to coach a little bit with baseball, but mostly with football with him. Uh, coach John Knuth, obviously, has won nine state titles and probably, obviously, one of the greatest coaches in school history. And uh, my friend, Coach Quinlan, who we worked together at the lower level football for 16 years, he coached uh, 41 years of football. And, you know, if you look at those, those guys, along with the first basketball coach that hired me in, which was Paul Jackson, and again, he's, he, he was uh, just a fun guy to be around, uh, happy-go-lucky, everything was positive about him. Uh, just all those guys, those six guys probably right there, uh, phenomenal uh, coaching staff. Those guys were you know, Hall of Famers in multiple sports and in the multiple wins. So I was able to pick up bits and pieces. Uh, I mean, I'm never near the level of uh, those guys, but it's just nice to work with all of those at one time or another. As far as in-class challenges, obviously, uh, those kids that have that come from you know our challenge backgrounds, uh, special needs as I guess I want some special needs kids, uh, those that are in, have been inclusive. But uh, what's nice about those kids is um, they've been in, included basically all their career. So once they got here, uh, we're able to find you know things that they can do. And, all the, and the kids are really good, so obviously they've been going to school with these kids their whole life and they're able to help out. They know these kids, uh, like even in the weight room, they're able to help out in the weight room uh, and then work with the kids, uh, know if they're doing something they're not supposed to and they'll, they'll, you know, they'll give me a heads up. And uh, so obviously uh, just the, the great group of kids we have to work with here uh, helped out there.